guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Hermitcraft. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm having a fantastic day. I'm going to warn you right now, this is going to be a talky episode. Uh, basically, I'm just going to be enchanting things and preparing some stuff for our final uh, push for the Civil War. We're all kind of getting together a team as we're gonna, and we're going to make a big push for the last flag uh, in just a couple of hours. So I'm just preparing some things, getting uh, iron armor, enchanted stuff ready for everyone on the team and all sorts of stuff like that. Uh, but that's basically what I'm going to actually be doing. So as for this video, uh, you don't really need to watch this video. This is one of those ones you could totally just minimize and listen to like a podcast because I'm not really going to be doing anything super interesting on screen. Uh, but I do have a lot to talk about. So as you guys have noticed, it's been a little while since Hermitcraft. It's been a while since Minecraft. I took a pretty long break over January, uh, uploading very sparingly and all that kind of stuff. Um, and I've been doing kind of a lot of thinking over that time and also just kind of um, did I need four iron yeah four legs two chest plates and one boots okay um I've been doing a lot of thinking kind of over that time um and also just over the last couple months you guys have definitely noticed I'm sure that over the last couple months my upload schedule itself has been uh pretty mediocre compared to like where it's been in the past I've been very kind of off my game um, and to be honest, the reason for that is that I've been just, just kind of dealing with just major burnout, just Minecraft burnout. And, uh, you know, I know that the majority of my audience, um, is interested in Minecraft and to be honest, for the most part, only interested in Minecraft. Um, but I've kind of come to the realization over the last few months that I can't, just see myself playing basically nothing but Minecraft, you know, eight plus hours a day or more every day forever. Like, it's just not something that I can do. I just, I kind of hit a point um, back in, I don't know, whenever it was my, my sporadic uploading started. I want to say it was like October, November-ish or something like that. Uh, I kind of hit uh, a point where I was just, I just wasn't having fun fun anymore, if that makes sense. Like, I felt like I was forcing myself to do stuff. And that's not to say that I, I've been absolutely miserable for every video that I've made or anything like that, but um, just, I just wasn't, I've, I kind of lost the excitement that I used to have, if that makes any sense. Um, I used to always be super excited about, uh, you know, making videos and uploading and all that kind of stuff, and it just hasn't really been that way lately uh and i think that's obviously not a good thing so i've been kind of um reflecting and trying to think um you know what i could do to sort of remedy that and i think i've kind of come to the the realization that uh, as far as like like i just i just need to do other things <laughs> <laughs> That's not to say that I'm quitting Minecraft or anything like that. I mean, you're watching a Minecraft video right now. I'm not, like, done with Minecraft. I'm not at the point where I'm like, I just can't play this game ever again. Um, but I am at the point where I can't do just this game nonstop every day on the main channel. And, and like, I just I just can't. <laughs> it's it's uh, it's kind of driven me crazy. And it's, it's stressful because... You know, um, like I know as a creator that that's what my audience wants. They want Minecraft. When I upload a video that isn't Minecraft, there's always comments that say, where is Minecraft? Or they say, I don't care about this. Give me Minecraft or, uh, you know, things along those lines. And like, I get it. That's fine. Um, you know, I, I spent the majority of my YouTube career, um, making Minecraft videos and building up an audience that is interested in Minecraft. But one thing about kind of the Minecraft audience in general is that for the most part, that's the only thing they care about. They don't really care about the rest of it. And that's unfortunate because I feel like a lot of those people would be interested in other things if they gave them a chance. You know, I feel like a lot of the time um, they miss out on things because that game 
isn't Minecraft, you know? And as a result, um, they just kind of write it off and say, I, well, I'm not interested in this. It's not Minecraft, <laughs> you know? Um, and that's kind of like disheartening. Like, I'm not blaming. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, actually. I should have made less swords, but whatever. We'll end up combining some of these anyway, because it's very important that the swords are uh, optimized. Um, like, I, I don't know. I just, I wish that I had, like, if I had one regret, on YouTube, it's that I did not uh, spend as much time uh, making my channel into a variety channel. I wish I had just been a variety channel right from the beginning, uh, but instead I decided to focus on Minecraft and pretty much only on Minecraft. Like, I did other games a little bit here and there, but uh, they were few and far between, and it's kind of come back to bite me in the foot. Uh, because now that I'm not as uh, excited about playing Minecraft in massive quantities as I used to be, um, you know, it, it's it, it, I'm kind of at the point where, like, I can either play Minecraft and give my audience what they want and not be super happy every day about everything, you know, not always be excited. To, like, I used to I used to wake up in the morning and I would go directly into my office and I would always be like, I would be in there nonstop until the end of the day. And I would love every minute of it. And I, I like, I wouldn't trade it for anything. Why am I trying to enchant a sword in an anvil? That's pretty, I'm pretty sure that's not how you do it. Uh, there we go. Um, and I, yeah, like that used to be something I was incredibly excited about. Uh, and now it's starting to kind of feel like a chore and I feel like, the reason that it kind of feels like a chore is because it's almost like Minecraft is the only game that I can play uh, and not be, you know, um, and not, like, um, I don't know how to put this into words. <laughs> it's, it's almost like I'm stuck playing this one game um, if I want to, uh, like, do okay. You know, because uh, like you can you can just look and like I I really don't want to be um, one of those people that gets like hung up on the views because that's not who I am. Uh, and honestly, like making this decision that I've made that Minecraft uh, is not going to be like something I'm not going to do anymore, but that it's going to be something that I do less of compared to where it used to be. Like that is one of those things uh, yeah, that'll be fine. Um, that's one of those things where, like, I know that it's going to hurt my channel as far as the views and all that kind of stuff goes. Like, I'm fully aware that it is not going to be good for my channel. I know that. I know it's going to do very bad things for my channel, in fact. Um, but I'm just at the point where, like, I accept that and I, uh, like, I need to do... I need to do what makes me happy. Like, I can't be my own boss and work uh, the hours that I work and do this every single day if I'm not enjoying myself, you know? Like, because that's, cause that's the reality of being a YouTuber is you don't really get days off uh, unless you, you know, work ahead so that you can have days off. You don't get vacation days. You don't get paid time off or anything like that. Like, basically, any any time off that you get is time off that you give yourself uh, because you either take a break, which means you stop uploading, uh, or you do enough, you do, you know, two days of work in one day so that you're a day ahead of schedule, and then you can take one day off, if that makes sense. But it's not like a traditional job where... You know, you show up Monday through Friday, and then Saturdays and Sundays you have the day off. That's just not how it works. So I'm at the point where, like, if I'm going to work six or seven days a week, I need to enjoy what I do. Uh, because otherwise, it, like, what's the point? Why Why am I doing this? <laughs> why am I doing this job if I'm not enjoying myself? I've got plenty of other options out there as far as jobs go um, where I could live a much more stable 
life, I guess would be the way to put it. Uh, you know, like, um, as many of you know, I'm, uh, well, now I guess I'm former military. <laughs> still, I'm still getting used to that, even though it's been, uh, oh, wow, it's actually been almost a year since I got out of the military. But, um, like, I could easily go back and work like a, a government civilian job, like a Department of the Army civilian job or something. And I could make a, a, you know, reasonable income and have full medical and dental and, you know, all the retirement benefits and all that kind of stuff. Because that's the other thing about YouTube. There are no benefits. <laughs> you know, I have to get my own health care and I have to, uh, you know, basically set money aside on my own for retirement. Like, there's no employee benefits, if that makes sense. That's a difference as well um, from this and the... Uh, the, you know, traditional nine to five type job. So like, there's a lot of, uh, there, there's a lot of things that are good about this job. I love being my own boss. Don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining about that. I, uh, it's not all bad. It's not all doom and gloom. But at the same time, if you're not enjoying what you're doing, I just don't really see the point, you know? Like, why am I doing something that I'm not enjoying? So I need to make changes. Uh, and those changes are basically... I need to play less Minecraft. Now, the key word there is less and not no. I'm not done with Minecraft entirely. I'm not finished with it. I'm not never going back to it. I'm not even done with, like, modded Minecraft, even though there hasn't been a modded Minecraft series in forever. Uh, and the reason for that is that I, I honestly just haven't really seen a mod pack in quite some time that has interested me. Um, which is unfortunate, but it happens, you know. Uh, some, uh, I'm not the only, uh, you know, like, I, I can't control what mod packs are coming out uh, unless I'm making them myself, and that's a whole other can of worms that gets, that's very time-consuming. Um, Hermitcraft, you know, I'm, I have no intention of leaving Hermitcraft or anything like that. I'll still be around. I'll still be uploading occasionally. I'm just not going to make Minecraft a daily thing anymore. It's kind of going to be one of those things that I'm going to focus for the time being on other games like Parkitect, which is still a very buildery game. It's it's very much like Roller Coaster Tycoon, if you've ever played that. Um, I'm going to focus on things like Subnautica and, you know, just other stuff. And I'm going to kind of do Minecraft when I feel like doing Minecraft, uh, because I need to do that. Like, that's, that's what I need to do for my own sanity um, and so that I enjoy what I do, because otherwise... I'm just going to be miserable, and if I'm just going to be miserable, then what's the point of working uh, a, a job like YouTube, you know? Um, it, people don't, as, as much as, you know, you hear stories about YouTubers who make absolutely absurd amounts of money, that's not the vast majority of YouTubers. That's like the very, very top tier uh, group of creators. Those are the people who get uh, you know, tens of millions of views per month. Those are the people who have uh, multiple millions of subscribers. Most full-time YouTubers make a pretty eh income. You know, not bad, but not incredible. You know, <laughs> I'm not driving around in a Ferrari or anything like that. Um, and, like, people don't, for the most part, people don't stay doing YouTube uh, for the money. That's not to say that there's nobody who does. You know, I'm sure there are people who found a certain level of success on YouTube and they're like, all right, this is what I do and this is what I keep doing because I'm making absurd amounts of cash to do it, but I'm not one of those people. <laughs> you know, I make, I make an okay living. Uh, it's been pretty bad over the last few months, but that's my own fault because I haven't really been uploading uh, a whole lot. So I can't blame anyone for that but myself. Um, what, what did I just do? Did I just throw something? Oh, no, I put it here. Okay, got it. Um, what? Self, you're losing it. Trying to talk and enchant at the same time, and it's going poorly. Um, you know, it's just kind of one of those things, like, I don't know. Well, why, why do what I don't want to do? So, as a result, there have been some changes over the last couple weeks, and there are going to continue to be changes. The good news is we're back to daily videos for the first time in forever, and that's not going to be changing anytime soon. We're still going to have daily videos, they just might not be the videos that you want to see, and you know what? I'm okay with that. Um, I, I'm okay with uh, people not being as interested in my other content as they are in my Minecraft content. That's fine, you know? It is what it is. It's not something I'm going to be excited about. 
<laughs> I would love for all of my videos to do as well as Minecraft videos, but that's just not going to happen. Uh, or at least not for a long, long time until I start to build up an audience that isn't only interested in Minecraft content. Um, but you got to do what you got to do. So um, I guess my point is that, you know, if you are one of those people who are only interested in Minecraft content, please understand that I'm aware that, <laughs> that most people are only interested in Minecraft. Uh, and I'm choosing to make non-Minecraft content despite that. Um, uh, this isn't the end of Minecraft, but it's the end of basically only doing Minecraft, if that makes sense. I need to diversify. I need to do other things for my own sanity. With that said, let's talk about some Minecraft stuff, right? So, uh, Hermitcraft, it's not going anywhere. I'm a little uh, sparse for ideas right now, but we got this Civil War thing going on, uh, which I'm preparing for at the moment, and then there'll be another Civil War video probably tomorrow. I don't know exactly when we're going to have our, our team's final push for that last flag uh, come out because we haven't discussed the when that video is going to come out yet. But that's going to ha that's going to happen a couple hours after I record this video, and then we'll probably have it out within the next day or two uh, after this video comes out, is my guess. Um, but then after that, I'll probably go back to, you know, the normal working in the medieval district and all that kind of good stuff. Are we... It looks like they're not mad at me anymore. Hey. Did I get one? Hey, I got one. There we go. All right, now they're all mad again. Good. Um, so Hermitcraft will still be around. Uh, Kingdoms is also still going to be around. The, the thing that happened with Kingdoms, um, I, uh, as you guys know, I was working on my custom texture pack for that, and I kind of made the decision to go, air quotes, all in on the texture pack and make a texture pack that is far more transformative than it used to be. It used to be more of like a vanilla plus texture pack where it looks still very vanilla in a lot of ways. And I've kind of made the decision to go all in and make it uh, much more, uh, much more involved, I guess you would say. However, I got started working with that and I kind of came to realize that it was just beyond the scope of my abilities to do it right. So I commissioned it out to Jermsey Boy, who is an absolutely fantastic texture pack maker, far more talented than me. Um, so the good news with that is that the texture pack is going to be like A plus when it's done. It's going to be incredible. Uh, the bad news is that I can't uh, I have no control over like when it's going to be finished. <laughs> you know, it'll be ready when it's ready. Uh, and when it is ready, I'll get back to making Kingdoms videos. Uh, but I'm going to wait until the texture pack is fully ready to go before that happens. He is working on it. Um, I've, I've been getting, you know, kind of updates on it and stuff. So I know it's being worked on. I know it'll be ready eventually. Uh, but it's a lot of stuff that he's got to do. So um, I'm guessing it may even be a, a few more weeks or a, maybe even a, a month or two. I, I really don't know because uh, he's also not a full time content creator. So he has other, uh, you know, real life obligations he has to work around as well. It's not just solely up to him. Um, so, you know, that'll be ready when it's ready. As far as modded Minecraft goes, I do want to do some more modded Minecraft. I just haven't seen anything modded Minecraft wise that looked interesting to me, like in recent memory. It's been quite a while since I've seen a mod pack that I looked at and went, wow, that looks awesome. You know, I'm just kind of like really tired of doing more kitchen sink, sky block, sky block uh, spin-off type mod packs. Like, I want something that is unique and uh, is an experience rather than something that's like, here's a bunch of mods, go play with them. Or like, here's your bunch of mods, you have limited starting resources, go do things, you know? That's the thing, like, I feel like if you watch a lot of my modded Minecraft series, they're very, very similar. You know, it's like, okay, we start out, we make this, and then we make these basic machines, and then we upgrade to slightly less basic machines, and then we have all the things, and now we basically have creative mode the end, you know? Um, and I, uh, I want to do something different. Like, if another regrowth came along, or another sprout, or, you know, something like that, I would be down for it. But I haven't seen anything for quite some time 
uh, that has been that. Um, most of what I've seen has been, uh, you know, just not, I'm not saying they've been bad or anything like that. They just haven't been anything that I got excited about. You know, it's, it, a lot of it has just kind of seemed like more of the same. Um, so that's why there hasn't been any modded Minecraft in quite some time. I'm sure sooner or later a mod pack will come along that uh, that tickles my fancy, so to speak, and that I'm excited to play and excited excited to try and all that kind of good stuff. Um, but it hasn't happened yet. So when that mod pack does come along, uh, I will definitely play it. I just <laughs> I just need to find the right mod pack that actually looks interesting to me. Um, and I think, you know, that's kind of where it's at. As streams, as far as streams go, yeah, I probably should be streaming, but right now I'm kind of just focused on getting back to getting into the routine of doing daily videos again, since I kind of got, you know, kind of off my game for such a long time. Streams will resume when they do. You know, second channel is still doing stuff. I'm playing uh, Resident Evil 2 Remake over on the second channel right now, which is fantastic if you haven't uh, seen that. It's far from family friendly, but if you enjoy classic kind of survival horror, or maybe not even classic, but I don't know. I'm, I'm absolutely loving it so far. It's uh, it's a little spooky if you're, <laughs> if you're not used to survival horror games, but it's super fun and I'm, I'm loving it. Um, I don't know. That's just kind of where I'm at. I, I had to, I, I feel, I, I feel, I felt like I needed to kind of explain what was going on. I've talked about it a bit on Twitter and stuff like that, but, uh, you know, that's Twitter. You can't always expect people to, uh, to know what's going on when you post on Twitter, because a lot of people either don't have a Twitter or don't follow you on Twitter or whatever. But often I post these types of thoughts and updates and things on Twitter. Also, one other thing I need to mention, if you haven't seen it yet, uh, Team Star did uh, a, a diss track. <laughs> we made a diss track. Uh, it was posted on Doc's channel a couple days ago. It's called The Super Weapon featuring Team Star or something like that. Uh, and it's a diss track, and I rap in it, which are, that's something I never thought that I would ever do in my entire life ever, but I did it, and did I think it actually turned out fairly okay, <laughs> much to my surprise. Um, but if you haven't checked that out, go uh, go visit Doc's channel and, and look at the super weapon, because it's a rap diss track <laughs> for the Civil War, uh, and it's quite hilarious. Uh, but anyway, I think that's about all I want to talk about in today's video. I know it was a lot of just kind of uh, rambling on and stuff like that, but it was a lot of stuff that I felt had to be talked about, and I wanted to get it into a video somewhere. Um, tomorrow, the Hermitcraft episode, that, well, probably tomorrow, the next Hermitcraft episode after this one, let's just say, will be far more interesting, and we'll actually be doing stuff and things. So, there you go. Guys, that is going to do it for me if you enjoyed the video. You know what to do. Links in the description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, my friends, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.